Hi everybody, it's day 31, the last one for the January Glue Book prompts. I should be able to read this okay because it's the last line. We have something old fashioned. Inside of that Sears catalog, this is an old treadle cabinet for a sewing machine. And you can even see the price. Zebra, I have two here. One scrapbook paper, one's an old sticker. I'm not sure if I'll use both. A pirate. That's off a of Culver's bag. <laughs> and I will give someone credit. See his hat? Instead of a crossbones, they have cross spoons. Isn't that kind of cute? Nose. The zebras have a nose. And then the nose of a plane. So I could use one or the other or both. And signature. I'm just going to put my artist signature at the bottom because this is the last page. Okay. Well, since this stuff is small, maybe we'll use both zebras. And I could just put the nose of the plane if I wanted, since that was the prompt. All right. Well, as I've said in I think every one of these videos, now I need a background. I don't know what I want. Na 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 na. It's first thing in the morning. <laughs> well, that's okay. It matches that stuff. It's a little dark. But I could live with that. What about the bottom half? Oh, is that better? Well, <laughs> I don't know. I like the cloud. The rest of it's awfully plain. And we can't have anything stripey down here. That's not going to look right. Oh, could do sewing pad. I haven't done anything with tissue, sewing pattern tissue. I know I have some here. Yes, I do. Be fine but you know those dots are going to show through I'll have to put something under it anyway Okay, let me pause and glue this stuff down. It's not done. I, you know, that's too plain for some of us. No pun intended. Okay, I'll be right back. Then go back to bed. Okay, not everything is glued. Yeah, the paper's different. This is the reverse of that dark blue. I like that better and then left some showing. I didn't point out that plain I had saved from another prompt. Plain was the prompt, and I had two planes out of that kid's dictionary, and I didn't use that one. So it behooves people not to throw stuff away right away. No, that's okay. Oh, and there's a 31 on there. Oh. <laughs> that's a little freaky too early in the morning for that and I did sign it and I know the word up there is upside down I don't care if if I did it the right way 
I would have had the straight edge on this side. I didn't want that. If I turned it, you know, to its back, then the lines were sort of faded. So I think that's fine. That's sort of bizarre. Oh, I caught the foot under there there. Okay. Well, it's still sort of leaving room there. Does airmail do anything for anybody with the plane? Okay, yeah, actually, I kind of like that. not sure when this video will air but I am actually ahead of time so we'll see okay well let's just glue that down this is kind of slick I was thinking I could put a postmark stamp here and there I don't know if this would take ink though it's sort of like a vinyl sticker All right, this can go down too. What am I gonna do there? Different washi? Oh, that 3131 is scrap of paper, and that's exactly how it was on the paper too. So they had 123, 123. Yeah, this is sort of lucking out, isn't it? And I've been saving this for a long time. I noticed Pirate way back in the beginning, and I saw this on a Culver's bag, so I saved it. <laughs> Surprised I didn't lose it. supposed to be an ice cream cone. Were you getting that? I guess that's their little mascot spokesperson. I don't know. In this zebra, I noticed when I was getting it's either the monkey or the gorilla, so I say that. Okay. Well, what to do there? More washi? I don't really like any of those. And we can't go over our great signature. Um, yeah. Ah, uh, I'm stepping away to get more washi. Okay, I'm back. Well, no, that's too busy. Yeah, I don't think I want another real image type thing down there. It's getting to be too much. I don't like that. Next. Oh, what about this because of the color? It 
It's okay. Oh, I never thought my, uh, the prompt that was monster. I have where the wild things are tape. That might have been neat. Oh, well, it was always thus. I don't think I have any zebra washing tape. You know, I do have. No, I'm too busy. Other zebra paper, little zebras on it. I don't know how quickly can I find that. Talk amongst yourselves. I'll give you a topic. I don't know. Scrap of paper is hard to find when you want it. Yeah, it is. All right, folks. I'm going to have to... Oh, wait, 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 wait. What about a couple little tiny zebras going across? I should probably put my glasses on for this. it's morning and I didn't have to cover the sun from getting on my counter it's been so cloudy I know I commented on that in some video we had about four seconds of a little bit of sun yesterday and I really I cannot tell you guys the last time we had a sunny day around here maybe that's why I'm so punchy All right, let's get rid of this. Well, <laughs> I don't know, I think more than one is it's going to start looking too busy, but it still leaves the big gaping thing there. What about something really narrow? We'll never know. Yeah, that's pretty good. Well, should we just put this on? It's a line from where the wild things are. I'll eat you up. I love you so. Let the wild rumpus start. Well, I like let the wild rumpus start, even though this is the last page. <laughs> All right. We'll get that to fit in there. And then I think that's it besides trimming. I don't know. Do we want a postmark? Let's put it on the right way, Diane. Get it straight, too. Well, I have a sneaking suspicion. If I put a postmark somewhere in this area, it's going to pull that much more up and possibly make this area look that much more lacking. What about a couple like on the edges? Let's try that. And for any long time viewers, I actually took the time the other day and marked all these stamps with a little dot of paint so I know which way they go, which, you know, end is up, and I don't have to pause and look at the lamp and try to figure it out. Oh, 
Okay, one. There's another one. Of course, these round ones are a little hard to kind of figure out exactly where the <laughs> the mark is, but pretty good. Okay, I think that's enough. Okay guys, this is the last one. Let's do a little trimming here. And don't despair, I have to do something with the cover, so I imagine there'll be another video coming. Okay, so it's something old fashioned is our treadle cabinet for a sewing machine there. Zebra, we have three. Nose, the nose is a plane. Zebras have noses too. The pirate doesn't. Pirate and a signature. Yeah, I like that one. Okay, and speaking of the cover, was anybody ahead of me on this? I should have made two signatures. I didn't. I thought, well, eight pages. That's not that's not much. I've done signatures with actually more than eight. And I trimmed I did trim it all off. Well, it's bulked up enough that these pages are sticking out. So the cover that I cut does not actually fit it and it looks pretty DUMB. So I'm going to have to come up with a new cover. So I either will do that in a video or at least come back and let you see it. But that's it. So here's today. Thanks for watching everybody and I hope your day is a good one.